Hi Sagittarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your weekly reading for January 1st through January 7th, 2018. This is for the sign of Sagittarius. Now generally my readings are love readings. We will see what comes up. Oh boy. Oh shit. That's what that card is. That's the tower. Anyway, um, nothing you guys aren't used to. <laughs> Sorry to say. I will focus this camera in once I have the cards laid out. Like I, I don't even know what I said because the card fa fell out. But anyway, um, I have pre-shuffled, so I'm only going to shuffle for a minute. And I have to remind you guys that you know these readings aren't for every single person. All right, so just take what resonates and leave the rest. So we have something, some kind of shakeup on the horizon, okay? Right here, we have a shakeup. It's the first card, it fell out. It was that oh shit card, okay? You know, so some kind of shakeup is on the horizon. Happy New Year, um, you know, but it might help you to let go of something, hopefully. I mean, it might help you to let go of something, something that might force you down a new road because you've been on a dead end. You know, this is a complete shakeup, but we're gonna get into it more in a minute. Um, yeah, there's something going on here. Definitely. Something is about to no longer be a mystery. Okay? The mystery is about to be revealed. Alright? Um, yeah, it, it appears to me like you guys are going to end up letting something go. Something is going to be let go, and I'm not sure what it is. Something is going away, you know, that needs to go away. It may cause some grief. It may cause some hurt. It may cause some, um, you may feel at a loss, okay? I see, there is some kind of loss this week. And, and, and sometimes loss is good, so don't get all worried about it, okay? Sometimes loss is good. It leads to something new, okay? Because we have the world card. So this is this really is good because the world is right next to the to the tower. These are both to me the universe, okay? They both signify that the universe has big plans for you. Okay? So just keep that in mind. Universe has got your back in some way, even if it's scary. Even if something happens that's a shock, you know, the universe has your back. So just, just rest assured that everything is going to be okay. But anyway, I'm going to get to this in just a minute. Let me focus this a little bit better. I think some dishonesty is going to come out. Something is going to come out. Some kind of secret. Something karmic is going to happen. Some kind of truth. Okay? Something that's been hidden. Somebody has been being dishonest. And I think that, you know, it's about to be revealed. That's what I see. I mean, there's some dishonesty here. No doubt. With the Justice card reversed and the Ace of Swords reversed. Something has... Somebody in your life has been... Uh, unjust, okay? Lying, no shit. The, sorry about the shit, 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 but obviously it, there's a reason for that. Um, um, this is the Seven of Swords, so yeah, there's some kind of lie, some kind of deceit here that you might not be too excited about, okay? You know, I think you've known this was coming. Your hunches were telling you that something was up, and now, you know, it's up. It's up. The time is up. The time has come. Um, and it's actually, it's actually a good thing because it's, it's been heavy. Whatever this is, it's really been weighing you down. It has. And now, it, now you're letting it go. And you may not even know you're letting it go because it's going to come in, come as a shock. Okay. It's like the universe saying, okay, it's time. It's time for change. You know, it's time for, for Sagittarius to, to step over the finish line and start a new life, start a new chapter. They've learned their lesson because this is the lesson. So, but you know, because you guys have been kind of um, oh, sticking it out. You've been sticking it out. That's when the tower comes in and says, all right, all right, enough is enough. 
this this falseness that's been going on has to come out. So I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a little nudge, and this nudge is gonna be like, oh, an avalanche. <laughs> okay, so this this whatever happens, you know, is gonna force you to take action. All right, it's gonna force you to take action, um, which is amazing. It really is. Um, you could be attending some kind of gathering this week towards the end of the week. A gathering um, that. Uh, I don't know what the gathering is, but there is a gathering here that somebody might be attending, you know, that, that you've been waiting for. So I'm not sure what it is, but it's it brings about some kind of peace, whatever this gathering is. Um, there's a mystery about to be revealed. I just, I know that I'm repeating myself, but that's absolutely the truth. A cycle is ending that needs to end because you guys have been stuck in this cycle and it has not been... Uh, it hasn't been serving you, okay? It had the justice hasn't been being served. It's like you guys have been um, taken advantage of, and you know you. It just it's really you ready to move on. You're ready to move on, but you haven't been able to. So that's why the universe is here. It's saying, okay, these these guys, they it, nothing's changing. So we we have to help them, and that's what I see. I think that. It's it's you are about to detach from a situation that you have been you've been resisting detaching from it, but you've wanted to detach from it. Do you know what I mean? Now you're going to be forced to struggle through it because detachment is on the horizon. Okay, because it feels like you've reached the end of the road. You're at the end of a situation, you know, and it is time for justice to be served. It's time. Okay, enough of the lies, enough of the deceit, enough of the dishonesty, enough of the secrets, you know, it's it's over. It's 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 definitely time for something to come out and it's going to. There's something is going to have a very big effect on you this week. January 1st through January 7th. I just need to remind you guys that time is fluid. This could have already happened or it could be happening, you know, the week after. Okay, but this is generally for the week of January 1st through the 7th. I feel like action is about to be taken because you've been stuck in a spot where there was no growth. There you could not there was no passion left inside of you. And now it's time to move on. And because you guys weren't really taking the lead that's why the universe is here the universe is here to cause this this mess it is going to be a mess i have to tell you somebody is going to be involved in a mess and it, at first you may feel like oh my god this is unbelievable this is such a loss but it turns out to be a blessing in disguise okay wow right <laughs> that's what it is too wow wow Wow. I have goosebumps, by the way. Have no fear. Have no fear, okay? It feels like, you know, you're, it's, this is all happening so that, so that change can happen, all right? This is a blessing, all right? Um, something... Um, a cycle needs to end with that moon card. A cycle needs to end, and because you haven't, you haven't, you haven't ended the cycle yourself. You know the universe is here to say, "All right, we're gonna we're gonna end it for you." And it's a karmic cycle. There's a karmic cycle here. You could be dealing with a Libra. You could be dealing with a Pisces. You could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, which is probably be yourself. You do have a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well. So that's who I see, but um, the you guys have been resisting this change, and you've only been resisting it out of comfort. Unfortunately, I think you might be pushed outside of your comfort zone a little bit, okay? Because when that tower card fell out of the deck on its on, all by itself, when I was still shuffling, that says that's what's going to happen. Out of the blue, something is going to happen that changes your life. It changes your life. It changes your course. It changes your path. 
It's, it's meant to be. So just go with it. Don't resist it. Don't resist the change. <coughs> that moon again reversed. The devil. Imagine that. Yeah. Have no fear. Remember I was saying earlier, have no fear. When this happens, it's going to happen quick. And so it happens quick and it, and it ends quickly. Okay? So you're absolutely going to be fine. Um, <coughs> excuse me. I put this off because I have a cold. Anyhow, um, yeah, you are going to have to have strength to get through this. Okay? Don't be scared. It's, this is an, and I really have to reiterate that because I see that you need to have no fear. Have no fear, have no fear, have no fear, have no fear. Okay, seriously, have no fear. You are going to get through this just fine. It is meant to be. <clears throat> it's time for you to open up. It's time for you to have strength. It's time for you to use the force within you to face your fears. It's part of the lesson. There's a lesson here. When the world comes out in a reading, it means there's a lesson to be learned. So yeah, the tower's here too. Something is going to crash. Something is going to break down. But it, it helps you to complete a chapter. Okay? It really does. So you take it as it is. Take it as it is. Think something, some mystery is no longer going to be a mystery. And I have to remind you, you could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Leo, Pisces, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Aries. That's what I see. Anyway, um, remember, remember uh, who you are. Okay, remember who you are inside, all right? Remember um, to have pride, okay? Because I keep looking at this and it seems like that there's pride here. And pride might get in the way. Maybe that's why you haven't taken the steps is because of pride. You should be proud of who you are. And maybe that's why this is happening. Because you're not proud of the situation you're in. And it's time to be proud again. You know, there's been definitely been some lies. The devil brings lies. Okay? There's been some lies. And I feel like these lies are about to erupt like a volcano. Okay? There's been something that you need to free yourself from. And the universe is here with the, with the tower and the world card. Those are both universe cards. Okay? The universe is here to say, okay... It's time, okay? It's time. You know, and it, it, you know, you may feel like you're down in the dumps when this happens. You may feel like you've done something wrong, or you may have, um, feel like it's, uh, scary, you know, but, but don't, don't, because everything is going to be fine. You may feel like just, uh, covering your head and, and not dealing with it, you know what I mean? Like, oh my God. I can't deal with this shit. You know what I mean? I can't. I, 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 there's a lack of ambition once this happens. It's like, oh my God. I, I can't even get out of my way at this point. There could be some uh, um, withdrawal. Okay? You could feel like withdrawing. You may have fear of the future. But the fact of the matter is, you're going to be fine. I see victory here. It leads to victory. It leads to wish fulfillment. It does. It leads to your success because where you've been at hasn't been successful. It hasn't been. There's been lies. There's been deceit. There's been tricksters or tricky or trickery, whatever you want to call it. Somebody has been indulging in the wrong way. Okay? It's, it's like there's been some kind of evil force that has taken over and now it's done. It's over. Okay, it's about to come out on the table. It's going to bring you the ultimate happiness, okay? It really is, trust me. Whatever this is, that, that this false foundation, this false um, connection, 
you know, that you've been in, this, this trap that you've been trapped in, is about, you're about to be freed. That's what it looks like. You're about to be freed from this trap. But the thing is, is, what's that? I'm trying to think of what's that called. I have this notion in my head. You know, it's like when a captive, a captive um, gets their person and brainwashes them into thinking what they're doing is correct. It's like, that's where this card is. It's like, man, this is, it's like you've been brainwashed, you know? So it feels like it's good. At first, it's going to be like, whoa, this is a shock because, you know, it's a shock. But anyway, you get through it. You get through it. And you get through it quickly. It comes and it goes pretty quick. Okay, so have no fear hearing this reading. Have no fear, please. It's the start of a wonderful new chapter. It really is. This is success, so don't worry about it. Something big is ending. A huge completion is on the horizon. And it allows you to use your strength. Okay, you're going to be using your strength and it's going to bring back your pride. It is. It's like your pride has been, you've been brainwashed for lack of a better word. So the tower is here to say, all right, it's over. That's what I see. I mean, I'm, I'm not going to even try to go any further because I, that's what I see. It's like you've been lied to. You've been manipulated. And that manipulation is about to be done. Oh my gosh. Ain't that a good one? Just what you needed. Have faith. <laughs> Please have faith. That's the perfect card for this, huh? Have faith. Trust your faith in this situation. When we truly believe that things will work out, that faith will confidently see us through. The angels are with you. This is something that you can have complete faith in. Knowing simple truths will give you the answers that you are seeking. Love is an act of faith. Faith. Have faith. This is what this is about. The angels are with you. Truths are about to come out. And it may be scary, but have no fear, have faith. You're, this is for your better good. It is. It's going to make you feel good again. At first, you might not. But in the end, you're going to be like, oh, what a relief. What a relief. So anyway, this is what I have, Sagittarius. I'm sorry to give you that reading, but I can't change it. So talk to you later.